Hi everyone, it's Mr Neil here and welcome to a summary of our recent S5 information evening which was called A Time to Focus. What I'm going to do is summarise the, the presentation that took place the other night for anyone that missed it. If there's any questions that come up on the back of this uh, presentation, please do not hesitate to get in contact and we'll try our very best to answer your questions. So the presentation was focused on these key areas. Uh, we started talking about Hillhead High Habits and Expectations. There was a bit of information on communication and support, some key dates in terms of formal evidence gathering and information from the SQA. There was an overview of the work experience opportunities and what FS6 looks like. And there was a focus on support and challenge. And for that, I was joined by Mr. Richardson, one of my fellow deputies, who took uh, everybody through some, some slides that I will summarise uh, just now in this presentation. So I started by talking about Hillhead habits and expectations, and, and all of these are probably familiar to you all from previous communications and information evenings last session, uh, talking about S5 pupils being ambassadors for our school, leaders in the community, about modelling those values that you see at the bottom of this presentation, kindness, ambition, integrity, respect and resilience. Also areas in terms of timekeeping, classwork, homework and uniform, which we're looking for on a consistent basis. Talking again about mindset and that phrase that was introduced last year about every piece of work has value. So these messages are very uh, consistent and they come across when I present at weekly assemblies and also daily Tannoy messages. So these messages are very uh, repetitive, but they're repetitive for a reason, because we want to make sure that the pupils are getting into really strong habits early, especially this year, which goes very, very quickly. And it's important that they, they know that we're here to support, but also challenge. So I then shared this slide, which was in regards to Hillhead habits of learning and belonging. So what we consistently want for our pupils here at Hillhead. And these three areas are areas that uh, my colleague, Mr. Carson, worked very hard on prior to the summer holidays when we launched the idea of Hillhead habits of learning and belonging. And these three areas are what we are looking for from, from our pupils. So we consistently want quality, or maximising of learning time, quality learning, and being part of the team. And these slides were shared with the pupils prior to the summer holidays. So I just took uh, all the families through this on a uh, Thursday night, uh, just to make them aware that this is the messaging that's being shared with our young people. So learning time, what does it look and feel like? It's about being in the class for the full lesson. And in green, there's the three areas that we are looking for on a consistent basis. And again, it's about being immersed in the lesson with no distractions. In terms of learning quality, what does this look and feel like? It's about attending fully to the learning and doing your best work. That's what we are looking for through all classes from all pupils. And again, it's about being immersed in the lesson with no distractions. So again, that's a nod to being distracted by any digital devices, mobile phones. So it's about making sure that we're focused on the work that is in front, uh, challenging yourself and taking pride in everything that, uh, that you do. And also being part of the team, it's been it's been great to see since we came back, the S5 pupils really leading by example in terms of white shirt and blue tie. So it's important that we continue with this. It just creates that feeling of being part of something and belonging to Hillhead High School. It's also about checking in with your teammates through registration. So we have daily action for registration based around discussion topics. It's a six minute registration, but you can still connect with others. And it's important that we try and encourage that communication, uh, verbal communication between uh, our young people. And it's also about contributing to the school values, both within the school buildings, community, and also out in the local community as well. So again, it's about feeling a sense of belonging. So those slides were shared with families because it gave an idea of what we are looking for on a daily basis and what we promote within our messaging at Hillhead. 
We then went on to talk through a slide which is familiar to you from last year's information evening but again just about the communication and support. So reference to using the S5 Teams pages and how we have daily Tannoy messages which really uh, push our school values and uh, hillhead habits. Again, it's about reminders, it's about repetition, it's about making sure that if you do the small things well, then that's the basis for future success. Again, there was a reminder about uh, the Expressions app, making sure that all families have downloaded that app so we can communicate with you. Also, the upcoming tracking reports uh, throughout the year give an opportunity for class teachers and faculty heads to talk with pupils but also plan a study interventions or a interventions related to individual a subjects and supports can be put in place on the back of the evidence that comes to light through the tracking reports because remember tracking reports are a snapshot of where your young your child is at a particular point in the year that information can allow us to work together in terms of the wider team, the class teacher, faculty head, support for learning, a principal teacher of a raising attainment, principal teacher of skills and achievement, deputy heads can all work together to put relevant interventions and supports in place. I then also shared the plan to continue with the optional family drop-ins that I have on a monthly basis. The first one will take place on Teams on the 20th of September. So it's just about having that point of contact with myself. If there's anything that comes up or if there's any questions that you may have, you can log into Teams, have a five, 10 minute uh, one-to-one conversation with myself and bring things uh, to me. And I'll try my very best to, to assist or signpost you in the right direction. So it was just uh, sharing that with, with the families that were there the other night. And as you'll notice, again, that phrase, every piece of work has value, is something that will be continually mentioned throughout fifth year to our pupils and families. I then spent a little bit of time talking about uh, some of the supports that are out with the school. So we've talked about East School uh, and West OS, which are uh, online offerings that are available in terms of webinars and study support. So I will be following up with more information on this over the coming weeks in terms of how to access the offerings that are out there. This can supplement what is going on in, in the classroom within Hillhead High School. And it means that, uh, or the advantage is that these can be accessed from home and it's all done online. We also talked about our supported study programme, which we hope to get up and running at some point soon. And also the fact that we have partnership working with, with people like uh, our careers advisors, etc. Uh, and other organisations when we talk about planning future pathways for our young people.